Hi! Today I want to show you how to export DSTV and C files from SOLIDWORKS Weldments by using the DSTV Assistant. Here we have a usual SOLIDWORKS Weldments part with all the structural members. To get started we create a new assembly. Now we switch to the DSTV Assistant ribbon bar and hit the quick start for assembly button. The entire assembly and all bodies inside of the assembly will be analyzed by the software automatically. Here's the result. Inside of the assembly we have uh, several identified bodies and unidentified bodies. For example, all the different sheet parts, we can zoom in, or L-shaped beams. This example, it's uh, for the gusset plate mounting, or the U-shaped beam at the bottom. If the software was not able to identify a solid body, we can teach how to deal with this part. To help out the DSTV assistant, we just open the correct property manager page and first of all we select the type. In our example, it's a sheet part. And now we can see the image. We just have to select both axes and then the software knows the orientation of the sheet. You can see the coordinate system is correct and then just Click Apply and the unidentified body is a user-defined body. Alright, in the next step we want to export all the identified bodies and to do that just right-click Export All and then we just add an order number, select the export path and click apply. That's it. Takes a few seconds to export all the files, but it's super fast. Let's take a look at the results. Here we have the new folder with our order number name and DNC export. Let's open an NC file to check if everything is correct. For example here we have a stiffener and everything looks good. The next example we select a beam and we can see all the bore holes and all the manufacturing information is correct. Let's take a look at the NC file itself and we can see everything's there, the dimensions of the beam and all the additional information like the boreholes. Alright, that's it. The DSTV assistant for SOLIDWORKS is super easy to use and can not only export the SOLIDWORKS weldments, uh, it's also usable for any imported geometry like STEP, SAT, IGES or others and of course also usable for the SOLIDWORKS structure system and of course usable for solid steel parametric for solid works. Thanks for watching. See you again.